Twitch, and today I'm going to be playing a game called Will You Press the Button? It is an online game where you are given a scenario and you must decide if you will press the button to make the scenario happen or if you choose not to. Press the button. <clears throat> and the first one is a very good question. You can teleport to anywhere you can imagine being, but only your naked body teleports when you do so. Ooh. I mean, if I did this. I would like have to stash clothes wherever I'd want to go, but I could not go anywhere. But then people would have to see my naked body. Ooh, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. Ooh yeah. Imagine in the future there's teleporters and that's how it works. Ah. You now have a green lantern ring, but you must go on patrol in space as a Green Lantern, and you can never see your friends or family or lover again. I don't know what the Green Lantern ring does, so I won't. <laughs> nope. Uh, it wasn't even this that got me, because that might be fun, but I don't know what the Green Lantern ring is and why I'd want it. So, next. Next! You get to live in Bikini Bottom, but you're a Patrick Star. I'm already Patrick Star, so I'm okay with that. <laughs> Aww. Well, I mean, some people just don't care. You will marry the man or woman of your dreams, but flying spiders will- Nope. Nope. I will not. Nope. <laughs> will hunt you for the rest of your days unless you stab him or her in the heart. Nope. You can teleport, but spiders can- Ugh. Can teleport too. Yeah, but spiders are probably not going to teleport to me. I think most of them want to be away from me. They just want their food, so... No. I can't risk it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't risk it! You could murder anyone you want without legal or moral consequences, but somebody will attempt to kill you every day for the rest of your life. Why would I want to murder anyone? I mean, I guess that's the moral consequences, but is it the same someone? What if I killed that somebody? Mm, no, I don't, I don't want to kill anyone. Yeah, a lot of people will agree. You may become the world's most powerful magician, but your family will die within 24 hours of your ascension. Um, no, I'll just do it on my own. I can just do it on my own. I don't need, like, a button to do that. You get to physically enter books for 30 minutes, but that book is The Hunger Games. Nope. <laughs> nope. I will die in that book. But it is not for only 30 minutes, but there's nothing appealing about being in the world of The Hunger Games. Whether you're in the districts or you're in the capital, it's just or even in the Hunger Games, it's just all now. Now. You become an immortal god and lead warriors on a crusade through the galaxy. Your son will strike but your son will strike you down. And you'll be in a catastonic catastonic catatonic state. Catatonic state for ten thousand years. I mean, if I'm immortal, I guess I don't really care, but I don't want a son. I don't want kids at all. Mmm. Nor do I want to lead a crusade through the galaxy, so I'm not gonna do this. These, these don't really appeal to me. I'm like, mm, people are kind of on my side. Not really, not really willing to press that button. Everyone will be happy. You get accepted in ho Hogwarts, but you get expelled, you two! No! I'll do it. <laughs> you get the PlayStation 4 early, but you only pay... You only play it for half an hour per week. Um, I already have one, so it won't be early, so I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> You can become an incredibly talented artist or writer, but you'll never have an original idea. You must rely on others to tell you what to draw right. I mean, I feel like that's just me now, minus the incredibly talented. 
<laughs> so I'm not gonna push that button. I'm already at their object. That's where I'm at. <laughs> you can read, write, and speak in any language, but no one wants to read or listen to what you have to say unless you speak it in the language you were originally taught. Unless you speak in the language you were originally taught. I think I would because then I could read all of the manga that I have in the other room that's in Japanese. <laughs> I do it for the manga! You'll get to live in any fictional realm of your choosing and develop any relevant powers or abilities, but no one will be your girlfriend there either. Aww. But I don't want a girlfriend. So I'm okay with that. You'll become the greatest artist in history, able to perfectly draw anything you want, but all anyone will ever want you to draw is porn. Yes, yes. Push the button! <laughs> Push the button! <laughs> I'm okay with that. I do it anyways. <clears throat> you get free tickets to see your favorite band, including backstage passes, but they hate you and they tell you to your face, No! I wouldn't like them anymore, so I'm not gonna do that. Man, I am just not a risk taker. You can jump two times your height, but you can only do it when you're afraid. Yeah, okay. I'm just jump over people when I'm scared of them. You can read people's minds, but you will always be awkward near people in real life. I don't really want to know what people are thinking. I know what people say aloud, and that shit's toxic. And you see what people post on the internet? Nope. I don't want to be hearing that all the time. You become bilingual, but you forget your native language. Nope. As much as I'd love to learn, like, some more languages, my native language is English, and English is widely used in the world, so that would be very inconvenient. You can have all the money you desire, but you can only spend it on Big Macs. Yep. I love Big Macs. <laughs> you found the solution for world peace, but you cannot tell anyone. Then I will do it myself. <laughs> Eternal world peace, but you will die tomorrow at this exact time of when you push the button. I don't know how long, well, I guess it's eternal, but you'd have to force people to believe that, no, I don't think there'll ever be world peace. You can understand any language, but it randomly changes each week. Ooh. Well, I still know my native language, though. Hmm. Mm. Maybe I'll leave this one here um, and ask ask you what you think if you can understand any language but it randomly changes each week would you push the button what if it changes your native language or what if it doesn't see there there is is the asterisk I need to know do I get to keep my native language and then understand a second language that changes because if so that's fine if it is a native language that's changing all the time like if it, I only am allowed the one language then I don't know but anyways you let me know down below and if you like this video then please give it a little like and if you want to see more from me then please subscribe and do all that YouTube shit and in the next video I'm gonna do something else so I will see you later Bye.